Are you lifting hard and heavy? I am, I am. I'm freezing, but I am. All right, it's pullovers, man. I showed you the pullovers, but that was just for the, uh, the attachment that comes with the Gold Gym XRS20. Well, what if I don't got that, Charlie? Well, I'm going to show a whole bunch of different types of pullovers. Uh, it's a great exercise movement that seems to have been forgotten. I mean, you got all the new machines. I've seen some that like Gates is in his arms and here like, like on a, and his handles and they sit in a chair. And, but it's different, it's different. Now this was real big, uh, like I said, 40s, 50s, 60s. I think they had a special bench. When I upload this, then I'm going to squeeze a picture on the front of old timers. They made a special bench, they called a moon bench, half moon bench. It would really arch your back over, you'd lean on it, and you'd be very relaxing. And you do these things. These guys were really into it. They believed it would help their chest. I got mags. I got magazines from way back then. And I'm telling you, these guys blown. You know. And they weren't working the chems they got now. If they were working them at all, I don't know. You know. So anyway, main thing you should do is understand you're not doing the stretch pullover like they do between sets of squats, which are very good to do. I, I advise you to do them. They just don't want to stretch out because you get a little dizzy, you know, and it puts the head there, stretches out the spine, gets the blood back in the head. Use a very light dumbbell. Uh, now, if you're at a gym, you have a guy hand you an easy bar curl. What a cough. Any cough all, all day. <coughs> It's about 19 out. I had to blow out my pipes <laughs> for my uh, sister. Anyhow, yeah, you have a hand on the, uh, the easy bar curl. You drop it and he grabs it, you grab it and you do it. Now the thing is you do it just like you're doing any pyramiding up. <coughs> Workout, you know, do a set of 12 or 10. You can start on 12 or 10. I'm starting on like 12 now. Or 10, 7, you know, 10, 7. And then five, and then do five, three sets of five. Or more, but that's one way to get to the five of five. I like to win it that way. Or 12, 10, 7, 5, 3, whatever the heck you want. But work your way to heavy weight. We're not doing, we're not doing some, we're not doing the normal stretch pull off. You're doing to work out. So you've got to work down to the least of five reps. At least five reps. All right, I'm gonna change it around so you see what I'm doing. Okay, at least five reps. Now you can do them with the dumbbells too, but first I'm gonna show you the setup I got, because I don't got someone handed it to me. If you got someone handed to you, you don't have to do this crazy stuff, all right? But you want to work yourself up to where you're doing a real five rep set. You know what I mean? Like 10, 7, 5, or like I said, 12, 10, 7, 5. You can even do threes, but five's good. And then you do a few sets of five. Five, 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 okay? But you're going to do it like you're really doing, like a five for five. You're really slamming. You're working it. You understand what I'm saying? You are working to maxing them reps. This ain't no whip stuff. You're really doing it. And you will see development and You'll be sore in your chest, your lats, everything. Biceps, try everything. Not biceps, but everything. Triceps, forearms. You won't believe it. Your stomach, too. I noticed it, too. Because you got to lock in. I'll show you what I'm talking about. All right, now make sure you get yourself, like, off the bench a little. Can you see what I'm doing? Okay, good. See, my head is off the bench, and actually, the bench is on... Uh, Past my neck. I'm not, the, my neck's free too. Alright, so I can get the day of thing. I've been doing them all day, so I'm actually pretty sore. This is, uh, I don't know, 60 pounds? No, 60 pounds. Oh, man, that hurts. Alright, there you go. Let me get to the Now, you know, I keep my arms bent. Like that, say. And that's it. Because after that, there's no more pull on the lat or the pec. 
But over here, right there, yeah, that's a pet room. And the lap, they're all working. And obviously the tricep. Ugh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's good, man. Ugh. That's another thing I do. I, I, I hope you guys do it too. You know, what muscles are getting pumped? Which muscles are getting stretched? Strained, you know? I can feel it. The thing about this is the lats and the pecs are pumping. And the triceps. So now I feel my tricep banging on my lats over here. It's, a super, it's, a, it's an upper body squat, fellas. That's something I can tell you. But you got to do weight. <clears throat> you got to do weight, man. If you don't do weight, it don't work. It's something else, but if you do wait. Oh yeah, I'm gonna crank it up, see if I don't kill myself. Oh yeah, I can do this. It's another 30 pounds. Let's see what happens. Another 30 pounds. I should have went up 10, right fellas? I should have went up 10, but you know me. You know me. Okay, hopefully it's worse. Yeah, should. Not my bang in there. Really need thinner plate. It's a problem with these uh, plastic plates. Hey, let me see. Let me see. So that's 60. About 90, 95 to, from the, yeah. A little more than 90. I think it's a 12 pound easy pound power. Uh, easy bar. Anyhow, yeah, okay. This will kill me most likely. Uh, but I want you to understand you want to go heavy. You got to get the right position. Your back's still on the thing. Oh, yeah, see what I'm saying? Yeah, man, I'm telling you. Oh, yeah. You got to get that extra stress going. Oh. Yeah. Oh, man. Okay, also you can do it with a dumbbell. Oh, I'm gonna hit that. Hold on. How can I show you? You can lean off the edge of the bench. Do it like that. Now do it like this. Just so you see. Can I do it then? Well, that work, fellas. All right. <clears throat> Get your head off the bench again. Can you say okay? You know, and you're working just like that from the gym. You know, you work your way up. They got 100 pounders, right? They got 90 pounders. You can do it like that. You can do it with singles, you know. One in each hand. <clears throat> cheating. <clears throat> oh yeah, and you can stretch them out. I'm telling you, and you gotta tighten your stomach every time. So it's like a crutch too. Crutch. Oh man. Oh man, that's good. Okay. 
So you see how he's doing, okay? Oh, I'm going to try to keep going again. Okay. Warmed up now, boys. Warmed up now. Oh, my shoulders. Okay. Okay, so you see, right? Okay. Now, how can I show you this? Okay. Right now. Hold on a sec. Need to make room so you can see. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Let me get this out of here, fellas. You get a little less of the stress going back. Then you can do it. With your easy bar curl. You know what I mean? Okay. Let me see. Okay. This is a light bar, but I'm just showing you the boy. You can do it with a bar. Can you see? Alright, so you can do it with a bar. Regular bar. Okay, get to wherever you like. I like it a little close. I don't like it out here. And you can do it. Now, because you're going heavy, forget doing this straight up, crap. You're going to be doing that bend up to here. Now, you're not going down this far because you got the floor here. But you can still get the weight heavy and get a good workout. You know, put it over 100 pounds. Come on, man. That's a good workout. All right, now on the... Uh, uh, the one I do on the bench with the straps, the thing is it's still pulling here. So when I go like that, I'm still getting that pull of the uh, bench, which I showed you on the, uh, uh, for God's secret, uh, back exercises for the Gold's Gym bench. Because the way it's pulling that way, this keeps going, so it's good for triceps. But on this, that'd be right here, okay? But this, keep it a little bit because we're not going to, yeah, this is easy now. But I'm talking about getting some heavy weight on it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So you can do that. And I, likewise, you can do this again. These are 30s. You can do this. Okay. Okay. Or you can do the doubles again. Okay, 30 of these here. That's 60. And you can do them. Ah, yeah. I'm telling you, man, you gotta do these. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, you gotta do pullovers. One form or another. Okay? I'm not bullshitting you. They're good. And then you gotta put them in your routine, man. You gotta put them in your routine. I mean, you don't got them. I put them in mine, I'll tell you that. I put them in my routine. Okay. Alright, so that's about it. I'd like this to be a little low. Hold on, fellas. You know what I mean? Can I win once? <laughs> that will be good. Okay, so. On the bench. With a guy handy, easy bar. Or you can make one of these rigs up. Obviously, it's self explanatory. Easy poke, easy bar, I've had that. And this, this bar, the easy bar, and these plates. Man. 30 years. They traveled me all over the country. Anyhow, I lost most of the weights. Anyhow, that's it. So you've got the easy bar curls. I'm going to hand it to you. 
you got the dumbbells, double, single, and on the floor. Plus the one I showed you for the Gold's Gym XRS20 with the straps. One of them has got to be one you can find that you like. So one of them has got to be one you can work with. The ones that are ground are fine. That little bit you're losing there, you can make up with more weight, man. Just remember, this is a regular workout movement, okay? So your normal workout strategy of a pyramiding scheme, the same thing with this. Once you get used, you know, you work, you start, find out where your levels are, so you know where to start. I've done them with this and 45s. So, uh, you can work your way up. That almost killed me, but it was something else. I never felt that music. So I'm going to start working out with these every day, every week now. Usually I'll do the one that's on the, uh, part of the, uh, the, uh, bench. But, uh, I really like these too, because it's a different feel. Different feel, okay? So that's all I can tell you. I would suggest try them. I'm getting a lot of good, positive, uh, feeling in my lap and my pec how it's I can feel it I'm pumped now I feel like I did a uh, bench I know it sounds nuts I feel like I did bench except my lats pump too and my triceps and my forearms and some other little muscles in the back there you know how they come up around the back so I can't say enough of this exercise it's been around since the golden age they had special benches for it. I'll get it all hooked up. And then I, I've got a picture I'll put on it. But it'll take a while because i got to upload it with this. And I hope I can do it is upload it tomorrow. But I'm kind of snowed in. And the ones that are only a minute or two I can upload from here. The rest i got to get into town. So we'll see. All right, that's it, fellas. Pullovers. Not just your stretch pullover. This is a workout major upper body compound movement. This is a super compound movement. My lat and my, I mean, I don't got big back, but my lats and my chest are pumped right now. I can feel it. I'm going to be doing some more to bring the bench back out and crank this weight up even more. I'll throw some more tens on there. I want to get over 100 from now on. Okay, that's it. Thanks a lot. Uh, 17 minutes. All right, lift hard and heavy, keep warm, keep safe. Ah, uh, yeah, getting there, boys. Okay, take care.